There are a number of different ways you can find parts of the model based off their part or assembly mark. Of course you've got your view filters, you can just double click on a view and go into uh, object groups and actually set up a filter here if you wanted to. So that can be at a view level um, and you've also got your selection filters as well that you can set up to, um, to select by a certain assembly number or part number. But another little tool that I found useful in the warehouse is one called the find number tool. It's a very very simple tool. Um, it just uh, again download from the warehouse. So you double click on the, the command on the right hand side. If I want to look for a rafter with say mark R5 uh, and then just click on find it finds the part uh, R5 or the assembly R5. It uh, have both ticked at the moment, part and assembly number, so it's going to look for both. If I change it to a P5, which is actually a part mark, uh, it then shows up the part mark of P5. I can untick that just to prove that's a part mark, and then uh, tick on assembly and hit find. I can't find it. If I change that back to an R again, it's now finding rafter mark R5. So again, a number of ways you can filter and find uh, certain part marks, but um, this little tool is, is quite quick, very fast, and very simple to use.